happening this weekend, the 101st Westby Snowflake Ski Tournament, and it's much more than just high flying action. You'll see when skiers fly off those ramps. Here with more, we have Addie and Matt joining us this morning. Good morning, folks. Good morning. Good morning. Can you believe we're already here? Westby Snowflake Ski Jump Weekend. It's coming right up. It's, it's definitely happening this weekend. So it certainly is. It. That's right. It's going to be a good one. So there's a lot of events that happened around the ski jump, Addy. What are some of the ones that you'll be looking out for this weekend? The opening ceremonies are definitely a big part of it. I'm looking forward to being a part of it this year, being up on stage. But I'm also looking forward to the long standing jump. Uh, it's where the jumpers just try to jump as far as they can, and whoever jumps the farthest gets a pot of money. So I'm very much looking forward to that. I'm going to put you on the spot this morning, Eddie. Have you ever uh, thought about doing some ski jumping like this? I may have thought about it once or twice, but I've never actually done it, but I would do it. Oh, that's great to hear. So maybe a future ski jumper here. And, and it's fun to watch. It truly is exciting to see those skiers. But there's so much more to this. So w what can kids look for when they, when they head to the ski jump? Or could parents uh, you know, let the kids explore a little more? Well, on Friday night, we have fireworks. But also, during all the big jumps, there will be a money pile with snow in it. So that's always fun to get money. <laughs> <laughs> fun for the kids, too. That'll be exciting to watch. You know, that's another spectator sport there. <laughs> so uh, I have to ask, because the snow has been a bit of a concern as we've seen these warming conditions. Uh, how are things looking as we head into Friday and Saturday? Actually, surprisingly well. Um, we have a, a great group of volunteers that put the that, that spend the time earlier in the winter to make sure that in situations like this that we have the snow and the, and the uh, facilities to be able to do what needs to be done. Uh, we have everything from chemicals to put on the hill. Um, we use liquid nitrogen potentially on the on the, the ramp part of the jump, which is called the in-run, um, just to keep it cold and make sure that we, we're able to have a tournament because obviously Mother Nature hasn't quite cooperated, you know, in the last week or so. So we want to make sure it's safe for the skiers, but also it's a great opportunity to see um, for the club to really show uh, how dedicated they are. Yeah, and it brings so many people from all over the area to Westby for this weekend. It, it makes it just a special uh, experience. So I'll be excited to see you two there at the big Westby Snowflake Ski Jump. Thanks for joining me this morning, folks. Yes, thank you for having us. Absolutely. Thanks for having us.